locked in the game. It's Madden NFL 24 on EA Sports, and this one features Chigazi Maconquo. He's coming off a solid 102-yard game. It's the Titans and the Panthers, and it's coming up next on Madden Football. Welcome back to the channel. Another game of Madden 24. Superstar franchise quarterback Eric Njigba. Week 12. Panthers taking on the Tennessee Titans. With Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. Charles, we take a look at this Titan ball club entering play. The streak continues, doesn't it? They come in a perfect 10 0. So the Titans set to go to work for the first time. Oh, rainy, slippery day. In the ball the first. Easter. Materializing as he'll get forward only for about a yard. The numbers on the ground for Henry last week. Because they want that rushing title as much as he does. They want to make sure they get him there. Second and nine now. Oh, look, defense. Yeah, when you do say 10 and 0, it can't scare you as a team. Just think about it this way. For most of the year, they've been playing to win their division and get to the playoffs. Now the playoffs are just about a four-ball conclusion. Oh. So now they have to down focus it. Let's go defense. This game their toughest test yet i absolutely do because to me this is a good measuring stick game because they've been able to take advantage of the schedule but here this good is job, the him. division but they the Super Bowl, so this game is crucial typically with that type of a back if he has any type of stamina it shows up later in the ball game because trust me guys get tired of running up and trying to tackle that big fella it wears on him and then he gets stronger and when you look at this team you definitely think that it is because anytime you can tell your offense just get us a couple of touchdowns we got this thing locked down that's when you know you're playing well a second down pass play there but it's incomplete to the nfl and since this is such a good unit of covering passes downfield i think that last play is typical of what we might see a lot of short passes see if they can generate some run after the catch and he will have a Titans first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. I don't care who you put on him, he's going to be a handful of one on one Yeah, right now you're right. They're in man to man. Maybe uh, needs some safety help. I would say that'd be a good idea. Double team him somehow. I'm going to have to make someone else beat me rather than let him shred my defense. Downs has the football position at the 43 as they come up first and 10. On the counter. Let's go here. Get through there, boy. This one not going have to have interest in the running game as well and they did a nice job there holding the point of attack and not giving ground now the pass and it's into the arms of Hopkins and they're going to have another first good job Hopkins huh? good catch the Panthers 41 yard line now, good is because just about any offense mm -hmm. that has an elite receiver if you blitz and have him in man coverage you're going to him even if he has an elite defender on him because he usually knows where the ball is before the defender does We'll get a pause here. There appears to be a Panther who was shaken up on that last play. Well, the medical staff 36 now. Here's second and five. They'll look to throw here. Mm. A hit as he throws there, incomplete. And he's only hit on two. Will have come up on the ninth play of this drive, needing five yards on third down. He'll look to throw. Incomplete. Strong coverage by Carolina. And on we go to fourth down. This defense has certainly played well Damn, so far in this game, and the coverage has been tight on just about every throw. First a few here so far in this game, and now it brings up fourth down.
Wow. The Titans offense now, they get set to head back out here. And it's only November, but the playoffs, we know how it works. They'll be here before you know it. If it ended today. It ended today. And I'll guarantee you, that's what they've discussed in their locker room, in their meeting rooms. Yeah, we know where we'd be if it ended today, but we also know it's not ending today. So they've got to continue to play the type of ball. 42 yards rushing for them now on just to show that they can run the football. I believe that they've done that here in the first quarter. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. And it's knocked away and incomplete. Wow. Looking for, they were very good in the win over Dallas a week ago. And while you can't actually see confidence rising in a unit, you can tell by this team, all right? Anytime you can tell your offense, good boy. just give us a couple of touchdowns. We got this thing locked down. That's when you know you're playing well and you're carrying your team along. First time they've hooked up here. Good for 17 and a first down. I know sometimes we can get fooled when we watch him make catches as we just saw him do there because he really looks like a wide receiver in line point of attack blocker that we used to have in the good old days. But you can flex him out, you can run wide receiver routes with him, you can make him a primary target, and that's how he'll shred the defense. And he'll fight forward on the straight ahead running and give their teammates time to fight to the ball and limit that gain. Here's second and eight. Got it. Downfield to Burks. And they're going to have another first down as the tackle's made at the Panthers' 17-yard line. We're going to pause here. There appears to be a Panther who is shaking a 17 now. Here's a first and 10. They'll try the right side with Henry. Pull here. Ten. Again, it's Henry. And he's going to be brought down just shy of the five at the six. Four times. No way I can find any fault with the call. He may not have scored there, but of course you're going to give it to him. Buying time Ooh. is left. Three nothing after one on EA Sports. Ready for the late Hopkins on the left side. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. Good job, boy. Trailing Burks, his fifth touchdown now on the year. And the Titans have taken the lead. Charles, every time that he makes one of these plays, I think the front office, they get a bigger and bigger collective smile because they feel more confident that they have found their guy, their future at quarterback. And they should feel that way. It's obvious he's a big part of why they have such a good record this season. You're right about the bright future as well. And by association, a bright future for the franchise too. Need a stop, need a stop. Need to drive straight down the field. Him. 
touches the rock. Back to throw now on first down. Looking deep downfield. And this is caught inside. Got it. Hit him. And really, it's not just the arm strength there, but the placement as well. To me, that was an excellent combination of arm talent and accuracy. The big play, a chance to finish now on first and goal. Henry. Oh, he's there absolutely nowhere as he is hit behind the line. That's going to wind up a loss of a full three yards on first down goal from the six this time. They'll give Henry another shot. And they get him down at the one. He had the broken tackle, but ultimately we can go all cliche. I'll go ahead and do it. Who wants it more here? Who has a better leverage at the line of scrimmage? Oh, and see what happens. Damn. And I don't think he got there. No, they stop him right where it all started. Only a few inches needed on the sneak. He didn't get to kick it. A chip shot. We go, baby. Going for it down three. Get in there. Kill him. Oh, he didn't get it. Huh? Wow. So they've gone for it twice now on fourth down of this game and both times unsuccessful. I wish we could hear the headsets now between the head coach and the offensive coordinator. Now that they're over two. Now here's the signal caller getting ready to lead this offense again. But a decent start for him here in this first half, but they're losing. And I think as the captain of the offense, you probably always feel like come along with him. And he feels like if I do better, everyone will do better. And that's what we're seeing from him right now. Got to have a little extra determination. Yeah, a little extra determination. He has thrown the touchdown pass. No good pass, good pass. Changes the complexion of things. Here's first and ten, just outside the thirty. They're going to look to throw. And this is going to be but they'll say out of bounds. So it's incomplete. Okay. And we know they'll be here before you know it. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Got his man, a conqueror. Down he goes at the 10 with a solid pickup. Second and two. And he's got his Good job. Strike. Good job. Their quarterback in this offense heading back out to the field. He had three touchdown passes in that game a week ago. He's got two already here. They'll indeed try to run it out as they start on the ground. And he'll just push his way forward for a few as the clock will run. It'll be a gain of three on what should be the final play of this first half. So we've reached halftime here in a four-point game. As we'll head down to Orlando, that's where we find our man Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach. Okay, Brandon, bye weeks, they're over. We've once again got a full slate of games to get to as we take you around the NFL here in week 12. 
We'll get started up at Lucas Oil Stadium in the capital city of Indianapolis. And it's the Colts on top as that one approaches halftime. Michael Pittman, a touchdown reception. Next, we'll head east. It's on to Cincinnati as we check in on the Bengals at home at Paycor Stadium. And they've got the lead in their matchup with the Pittsburgh Steelers. Tyler Boyd, a touchdown reception. Finally, let's get down to Houston. Check on the Texans at home at NRG Stadium. And they trail in that one as it's the visiting Jags who are out in front. Trevor Lawrence with a couple of touchdown passes there. All right, defense, let's go. Hmm. Wow. With their winning streak right now, sitting at 10. They begin with Henry, and he'll power his way forward for about four yards there on the first down carry. About themselves. Defensively, you have to feel okay because you didn't let it turn into a bigger run, but the goal, shut it down for two yards mm. or less. That's when you start to feel good about your second down incompletion. They'll come up now against a third and six. Back to throw. That is caught. Good job. There you go. Touchdown. There you go. snaps under center heading out for the next possession and you think he personally is evaluating his game so far he was pretty good in the first half and he set the world on fire in terms of stats it's almost like you're driving hands at 10 and 2 alert for anything out there watching for trouble on the road and making sure you get the team home the bus hill in a hurry and limited them to just a couple on first down No. Oh, nice defense. That was good defense against that. He's going to be swallowed up right away. This will be a loss of three and now a much tougher third down looming. Avoid punting from their own end zone so they could use something here on third down. They'll set up a throw. That'll be complete to a conqueror. 
The result only four yards there on the play. And that'll bring up fourth down. I think that call was made not so I had to try and get the first down. I won't go throw a deep. Taken if they could have gotten it, but to give their punter a little bit of space and try and help out their defense. Yeah, I got the safe completion on third. On defense, penalty. Damn. Mm. Damn. Damn. To tie it. That's the bad news. The good news. Plenty of time in this fourth quarter to try to grab that lead back. A first down carry for Henry. Gets through. And he gets this one just shy of the foot. Keep them tree trunk legs moving, boy. Let's go here. To play in, but neither offense has had much trouble. Plenty of points to go around. First and ten. Oh, man. Tries to power forward, but he will not. Get back to the line of scrimmage. Contend with a second and 12 after the loss. He'll look to throw. DeAndre Hopkins making the catch. Good catch, Hopkins. First down as the tap is made at the Panthers 43. We've got pause here. There appears to be a front Panther territory now. It's first and 10 at the 43. A shotgun handoff to mm. Scrimmage and he goes down right there. Back to throw now on second and ten. Nothing open downfield. He keeps it himself for a lot of the first I told him to slide. He dove for it. That key time, and that's what he did, although you and I both know it wasn't planned that way. But what a nice job using his eyes, scanning the field, and realizing when it was time to exit the pocket and go. He's able to break through one. Needed that one for confidence, just to feel a little bit better. But I don't know if I would be daunted by them stopping me on one run. This drive has gone pretty well. I could come right back at them. Now this throw caught left side. And they're going to have another first down as a job, D Hop, man. He's he using the mitts, man. I like that. And move the chains as well. And partner in a tie game in the fourth quarter. You're from the 17 now. Here's a first and 10. Mm. Trying to push forward, but he is going to be stuffed up in the backfield. Two yards, the loss, second and 12. Misstep on that last play because the drive has been strong, but now it's second and 12. They'll drop to throw. Mm. Everybody was covered. Did they go for it or something? Or did they miss a field goal? Hmm. Here's Tennessee ready to begin this Good stop. offensively. Excellent job by their defense to force the See what we can do. find them with this opportunity all tied in the They'll try and start this drive in the air. A short throw taken in by a Conquero. And he'll get this up to the 30 yard line. I'm seeing from them here. Tie game in the prime. All 
three timeouts still remain. Here's first and ten now. Back to throw here. Mm. And get it out of my hand. Brian Burns flies up it. Did a great job of wrapping him up and bringing him down. Second and 14. And that's going to be too high. Oh, shit. The crowd, the situation. This is NFL football at its best. Here's third down. Runs over it. Take this to the 47, but no further as they get him down well short of the line. To Will we be headed for overtime? I see. time it is come on defense come on defense come on oh my goodness three is over so no and there you have it in this game, first game lost game two, Charles. Each side got its points, but they did mm. defense that's so true and it certainly felt like NFL football at its finest thanks for joining me guys until the next one I'm out both of them aggressively pushing it downfield I did like Brandon how smart they were